hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's me again willy inc and uh, in today's video i'll be i'll be tackling something different and i've been i've been getting questions from clients uh, on the best way to prepare when you're getting ready to come to to get a tattoo so i decided let me compile some few tips and uh, and guidelines how to prepare yourself to come for a tattoo session in this video i'll be tackling how to prepare yourself for a tattoo session like a boss having said that guys if you're new here go ahead and hit that subscribe button it's just below this video hit that subscribe button also turn on the notification button so that every time i upload a new video guys you'll be among the first people to get notified guys if you have a if you have a, ta a question regarding tattoos or piercing guys go ahead and leave on the comment section and uh, for sure i'll reply to your comment in today's video the first thing you need to do before coming for a tattoo session you need to make sure you you take enough water for the past uh, you need to take enough water for the past 24 hours to ensure that your body is properly hydrated taking water it really in a could help out for your body to be to feel more relaxed and also it makes your skin wear a bit soft so that's why that that's the first point whenever you, you're preparing to come for a tattoo session it's good for the past 24 hours you ensure you may take enough water it really helps your skin to be moisty and it also helps your your skin to be a bit equal more relaxed yeah so you need to consider that taking water is very important and uh, that makes our first point let's get the second point the second point uh, is uh, of course you need you, you to get plenty of sleep you need to, to have a to have slept well before you're coming for a tattoo session uh, that that normally uh, uh, prevent you from uh, suffering from fatigue when you're getting the tattoo um, uh, sometimes when i feel like uh, you're very tired you know some of the tattoo sessions they take hours it may be a, t a tattoo session of around uh, six hours so it will be very very bad if you come for the tattoo on, uh, for the previous day or um, for the previous night you haven't slept well so it's really really advisable when you're coming for a tattoo session make sure umelala bizuri get enough sleep before you're coming for the tattoo session some people they come for the tattoo session but maybe somebody have have been working the entire night so let's say let me let me book the session before i get to my house so the guy anakuza from and come from from work to the tattoos tattoo studio he or she apart a tattoo and then go to sleep that is it's it's really discouraged because uh, in a situation whereby the tattoo session may last for 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 for, for hours you may find the client maybe an anasinzia of which it's really really bad yeah that's make our second point make sure you get enough sleep before you're coming for the tattoo session guys let's get into the third in the, into the third point and uh, the third point is make sure you eat a meal before the tattoo appointment when you're coming to, a, to, to get a tattoo don't come when you're hungry as I've, I've said earlier some of these tattoo sessions they take hours you can imagine if you come if you come to my tattoo to, to, for the tattoo you come to my studio maybe the best thing i can give you maybe it's a is a snack or maybe a refreshment maybe a juice or something and i expect you to stay there for six hours getting taking all the pain from the tattoo session and your stomach is empty you won't i don't think you'll manage so it's really really advisable when you're coming for the tattoo session kindly make sure you get your feet and something of of course make sure you have taken a nice meal and uh, you have taken enough so that when when you come for the tattoo session you can comfortably sit and uh, be patient enough for those hours 
that the tattoo will, will, will take for, for it to be complete. Yeah, so guys, that's, that's make the, the third point. Make sure when you're coming for the tattoo session, you have taken uh, a nice meal, and of course you have taken enough. In the school session, I need to go buy something, then I come back. Of course, when you're, of course, when you are doing the tattoo, I'll, there are breaks. Of course, I'll have to give you breaks. But see, breaks is uh, you go to the supermarket or you go to the restaurant and take a meal. It doesn't take that long, so it's around. Uh, I give you maybe a five minutes. I also stretch, yeah, and then we continue. So, guys. Some people they prefer you may come to that association carrying some snack or maybe a takeaway. It's it's okay. It's, it's totally okay. Maybe when um we are we are going through the tattoo session, maybe taking your meal. So that's totally okay. So having said that, the third point. So guys, consider that before you come to the tattoo session, make sure you have taken a meal. Guys, let's head to the fourth point. And uh, the fourth the fourth point is uh. You wear proper clothes. By proper, I mean by proper clothes, I mean uh, you wear clothes that you're comfortable. Sometimes you may find clients, maybe an attack or like uh, for men, somebody wants to get a chest tattoo. Now this guy, I'm a kuja na, I'm a kam na, na let's say kama, I'm a kuja na those those you see those gym clothes, those gym attires, the the tight clothes. You find that person maybe at a, he or she may 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 be forced a towing goes out, which maybe it's cold the the the, the climate or the weather during that day it's cold. You see, you try end up kutoa then all the clothes in your. It gives me in the inner the room to 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 do the tattoo. So guys, whenever you're going to get a tattoo, and uh, of course you know the 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 placement where you want the tattoo to be to to, to be done. It's good you wear clothes then you're more comfortable and uh, you can comfortably see it like for hours without maybe you feel like you're feeling cold or you need to, 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 to change. No, no. It's, it's advisable. For example, if for ladies when they're getting a tattoo on their, on their legs, at least if it's possible, you can carry maybe a shirt, a shirt maybe. And when you come to the shop, you, you, to the tattoo studio, you can change and at least you'll be comfortable and and um, if it will have to take hours you don't have kuniambia oh let me let me let me let me first warm myself unify kwanza trouser all those things so what i normally recommend to to my clients before they come for a tattoo you want a tattoo you want your tattoo to be placed on your arm kindly wear a short sleeve ama you wear a cloth that uh, utakuwa, utakuwa comfortable uh, yeah na it's normally it's normally recommended those not all people might agree with me whenever you're getting you're, you're coming to get a tattoo don't wear those tight tight clothes at some point you feel like uh, maybe uh, you'll have to sit for 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 three hours and maybe ngu kufinya. maybe you find some other people have on a, on a realize like Somebody wants a a, 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 a tattoo, kwa mgu. and the person has come with a very tight chin. 